Well, after days of public outrage online, a Hawaii Island man is apologizing for a viral video of himself urinating on Mauna Kea, a mountain sacred to Native Hawaiians. As KITV4's Ali Duclo reports, some Native Hawaiians say they act as another example of how some non-Natives don't understand Hawaii's culture and its sacred sites. Hawaii Island resident Travis Upright posted three apologies on his Instagram page. One with a caption reading in part, I'm so sorry to all of you. I was so arrogant and I just didn't get it. I'm beginning to, and I humbly ask for your forgiveness. I just thought this is very disrespectful, uh, you know, to, to Aina, uh, to land. Here are screenshots of the video. You can see Upright relieving himself high on the summit. Then here he is gesturing on obscenity. It was just the sense of entitlement and privilege to, um, you know, it almost says, um, you know, I don't care about my choices and my actions here and and I'm going to do whatever I'm going to do. However, Hawaii Island native Alfonso Kekuku acknowledged Upright's apology. I'm very grateful that he's able to acknowledge his um, ignorance and that he was able to, um, you know, come forward to, to speak about um, how he messed up. The Hawaii Tourism Authority has efforts to educate visitors on how to respect Hawaii and its people before they arrive and throughout their stay through ads and videos. A representative from HTA saying, quote, we will continue to do our part to help encourage better behavior throughout our islands, in our communities, and especially at Vahipana, or sacred places. Still, Kekuku believes tourists should be more proactive. Many people that move here um, and, and visitors, tourists, new residents, current residents here should really educate themselves about um, cultural sensitivities. There aren't really any prohibitions in state administrative rules against Upright's behavior, so he may not face any punishment. His online apology continued, I am so sorry that I hurt so many people. I want to understand what it means to hold life and the land so precious and sacred that I would protect it with my life. But not for me, but so I can teach it to the next generation after me, so that the pain ends with me. Ali Iduklo, KITV4 Island News.